Peace, everybody. Sweet Science Boxing Academy. We back with another video. All right, man. So, Javante Tank Davis, he responds to images that he see of Frank Martin training for his upcoming fight with himself that's supposed to take place in June. Now, Frank Martin and his team, they posting up videos and pictures of him in training camp for his upcoming fight. And Tank, he looking at this stuff and he pretty much said, None of that stuff that Derrick James and um is showing you is going to help you. So he basically saying that whatever Derrick James and Earl Spence and um try to help him do in training camp, it ain't going to amount to nothing on fight night because I'm still going to demolish you. Now, this would be Frank Martin's first time fighting for a world title. Tank keeps elevated to the super WBA lightweight champion. Ever since Devin Haney dropped his belt and moved up to super lightweight and took on Regis Progray for his WBC super lightweight title. And on paper, this would be Tank's toughest fight to date because for a long time, people have been wanting to see Tank fight a, a black fighter. He never actually fought a black fighter on this caliber. He fought a black fighter once early on in his career. But that's back when he was still fighting like six and eight rounders. But he never forced someone on the caliber of Frank Martin, who's softball, who's slick, who's undefeated. Frank Martin is 18 and 0 with 12 knockouts. He's 5'8 with a 68 inch arm reach. And he got that Earl Spence, Derrick James, methodical style. So I, I think he gonna give Tank a nice run for his money. You know, at first I said that Tank is just going to wash him, which I still think that Tank is going to win in the end. But I think Frank is really going to give him a tough fight. I think Frank going to train his behind off in this fight. And because people are doubting him, shoot, even you can even include myself in that I think he going to prove all of us wrong and show that he belong. So if Tank does win, I think Frank going to make him earn that one real hard. But like I said, I still believe that Tank is gonna win in the end because regardless of how hard Frank train and you know his determination, all that stuff, he just haven't fought on this level before. And he going into the ring with someone like Tank. Now, this boxing, and I tell you all the time, anything can happen. One punch can change anything. But when you look at the statistics, realistically, Frank it ain't gonna be no match for Javante Tank Davis. But like I said, all that can change, so we'll just have to wait and see. But that's all I got for now, guys. Let me know what y'all think. Drop y'all comments down below. Make sure I hit the like, subscribe, and hit the bell. I'll see y'all the next one. Peace.